Hi, my name is Alicia Clark, and I uh, live in Garden City, Kansas, and I am uh, going to be working for Holcomb, Kansas, USD 363, which is um, just about 10 miles outside of Garden City. Um, I will be teaching 7th and 8th grade English and reading, and this will be my second year. I um, started last year with the uh, first semester I did um, long-term sub and then in January I was officially a um, into the transition to teaching program so this will be um, my second year at Holcomb teaching seventh and eighth grade reading in English um, I also um, was sponsored for the drama club and we put on a projection at the end of the year um, it was um, called Walt's World it was a combination of um, several short uh, Disney um, skits put together and the children uh, really loved it um, the students enjoyed working really hard and getting to um, put it together and also the students uh, in the audience seem to really enjoy watching the production so that was a lot of fun um, also I have thought about maybe doing the school dance team next year um, what led me into teaching um, I actually have a background in um, science and healthcare um, however, a few years ago, um, about 10 years ago, I was between jobs and decided to substitute teach um, until I found something in the healthcare field. And um, I substitute taught out at Holcomb, um, did a lot of long term subbing um, while um, teachers were on maternity leave, that kind of thing. And I really enjoyed it, but then the healthcare um, opportunity came up and I. Um, went to be a surgical tech and I was doing that for a while and really enjoyed it but there was a lot of call hours that came along with it and one day it just hit me that I really missed the kids and I really missed the teaching and so I decided to get back into um, teaching and um, look into it and decided to do the transition transition to teaching program um, Let's see, so um, looking at the KSE website, one of the things that I realized was that we do have a high number of Hispanics. I always uh, knew that, um, but looking at the numbers, it kind of um, put it in reality really um, how much, um, how high of a Hispanic population we do have here um, at Holcomb. Um, and I feel like that is one of the biggest um, struggles also um, in my classroom is being an English and reading teacher is the language barrier there and um, trying to make sure that the children um, students can understand um, the language um, is a big struggle for me and I have planned on um, looking into how I can um, help them out with that more um, I think that's all. So I'm um, looking forward to um, taking these classes and getting some more information under my belt and helping me out with the next um, school year. So um, best of luck to everyone. Thank you.